thank you to get to the best suite <laughs> in the hotel. <laughs> Brett's actually carrying my chair for me. <laughs> oh god, he's here. <laughs> Brett's having to carry the chair. <laughs> oh god. So, um, we've literally just got to um, the Hilton at Northampton and we're in the suite and it's really nice and um, so far uh, we've just done a quick look around and we've literally like obviously got in here and um, I had to bum shuffle up the stairs because unlike what a certain website said this place actually has no lift now some of the booking websites actually said that there was a lift um, which put my mind at rest. But anyway, this is actually the best suite in the hotel as well. So it's kind of a good thing, I guess, that I did manage to drag myself up here on my bum. But anyway, um, here's the room tour. So this is literally what you come out into. Um, by the way, I'm filming this on my action camera, so sorry if it's a bit weird. Uh, this is our living area. We've got the, a large TV. Which I believe is Samsung. Tea and coffee. Unfortunately, no Nespresso machine. Um, good selection of teas there. Some coffee, some biscuits. Um, storage space. More storage space. Um, a living area. Desk with phone and a hairdryer. Which currently has all of mine and Brett's stuff on it. Um, let's see what the view's like out here. Ah, uh, well, you see the roof, but then above that you do actually get to see some fields and things like that. Um, this I think you'll find is quartz, the table, which is really nice. It gives it a bit more of a premium feel. Um, this room um, retails at around 160 depending on the night you stay um, if you're including bed and, bed and breakfast so bed and breakfast right we'll go to the bedroom then we'll do the bathroom last I just want to see what else is in these drawers have a sneaky peek see if there's any sort of like oh we've got a fan there that's a good start so I won't need to phone up reception for a fan looks like they're all empty now Bedroom, king size bed, which is brilliant because all the others are really small doubles. Um, another smaller size TV, I'd say, I think this one's about a 42 maybe. Um, again, Samsung. More drawers. <laughs> I'm just seeing if there's any like laundry stuff in there. Like, you know, because sometimes you get like laundry bags, but obviously not. And these guys. Uh, alarm clock on one side. Phone on the other with a notepad. Views of the same roof. Views of yeah, views of the same roof and field. Um, this, is, however, is really disappointing. I have never, in any of my room upgrades, so executive room suites, etc., etc., I have never had to pay for water. I'm not joking, they have a bottle of water with two glasses, but if you use it, it costs you £2.50. 
this this didn't even happen in the Double Tree by Hilton. Um, the Double Tree by Hilton actually had like things like free chocolate crisps, wine, um, as much water as we needed. You know, that's kind of a bit of a kick in the teeth, really, when you're paying £160 a night for your room. Um, you know. So, yeah. I need to see if... Brett, are you okay? Okay. Unfortunately, I can't do the room, uh, the f bathroom yet, because Brett's using the bathroom. But that's okay, because we're literally just dropping our stuff off and then going out for, ta uh, out for something to... Um, eat uh we did because of the inconvenience actually i'll turn the camera around because of the inconvenience um caused to us they did actually give us um some free drinks vouchers so i think i'll go and find those and i'll just show those to you so we can kind of see what they actually have so they're downstairs in the bar they did ask us at check-in if we wanted dinner reservations we i've decided against it i mean when you look at the prices of room service okay which is like here I mean, they're all pretty reasonable for a hotel, but we're in Northampton, I'm pretty sure there's somewhere else that is much better. Um, anyway, let's go and try and find the um, drinks vouchers so I can show you. So these are our room keys. The room keys? Uh, Brett, have you got the drinks vouchers? That would be why then. <laughs> I was looking at the room key and uh, yeah. turned out Brett's got the drinks vouchers. No. Huh? Where are they then? Yeah, okay. Why? There's a cracked tile. There's a cracked tile? Yeah. Oh, by the way, before we continue with the room tour. Joe Malone sent me some stuff, so I'm happy. Um, stuff to try out. Uh, I thought I'd try that out whilst up here, because I like Joe Malone stuff anyway. Especially when you can get it at like really heavily discounted prices at Bista Village. Um, but it's nice when you kind of get like little treats and stuff um, from people, so yeah. I believe Brett is finished. I will check the drinks vouchers and then we'll continue with the bathroom of the suite. There is Brett. Say hi, sweet. Hi. Can I have the drinks vouchers a second? Ta. Okay, so. Free cheers for relaxation. Complimentary drink terms and conditions. This certificate is valid for one complimentary drink at a designated hotel, restaurant, or bar. The hotel where the certificate is issued. Drink offerings vary by hotel. Certificates not valid for room service and not valid after checkout. Gratitude is not drink Serving of alcohol, blah de blah de blah. So it doesn't actually say what drinks you can get on it. That's really flipping clever. Um not, at least with A cause drinks vouchers, they tell you. Anyway, on to our bathroom. Oh dear. So, hi! <laughs> Let's start. So, the sink looks really nice. Uh, Peter Thomas Roth. We've got shampoo, conditioner, body cleanser, body lotion, facial bar, uh, shower caps, um, relatively standard toilet. Uh, I like that. They've got grab rails on the bath. And... I think you'll find the bath's actually a jacuzzi bath. These come up. Yeah. They're a jacuzzi bath. I'm pretty sure they are anyway. I have to find out how that's going to work. Maybe that's the button for it. Maybe that's the button for it there. Um, towels. Ah, yeah. <laughs> I don't know if you can see that. The cracked tile that Brett was talking about. Come on, that's really poor for a four star hotel, like seriously. That's a bit ridiculous. Um, is there anywhere else? Oh yeah, by the way, this suite upstairs, um, if you are travelling with family, is uh, adjoining. So it does have an adjoining room. Um, aha, bathroom. 
crib slippers are all the way up there. Iron board safe. Ah, uh, there's the laundry bags. So yeah, that is the room tour complete. I'm sure Brett now probably wants to go and get something to eat. I know I do. I was the one that drove up here. So yeah, because I can only drive. I'm the only one that can drive at the moment. But I will talk about that in the uh, in my next sort of like vlog update anyway. Um, yeah, anyway, hope you enjoyed the room tour. Check out the blog. Um, make sure you give me a follow on um, Instagram, Snapchat, etc. And also subscribe on YouTube if you're watching this from YouTube. Um, yeah, speak soon. Right, guys, so you're not going to see me in this one because I'm trying to wheel around here. But I just wanted to show you, as well as the photos on the blog, I wanted to show the actual guys on the video who are watching the video um literally how big this breakfast buffet is and some of the stuff like oh my god okay you got like all your fruit your yogurt stuff granadas tomatoes onions loads of different cheeses meats and then this really made my day you actually have smoked salmon and other fishes other types of fish as well but they have smoked salmon on the breakfast. I was like, oh my god. Um, it's amazing. Selections of breads, toasters, rolls. Loads of like selections of different like jams, marmalades, honey, marma uh, marmite, peanut butter, because everyone loves peanut butter. Brett, say hi. <laughs> And then you got like porridge. And then it's like the full English, this is like hot English breakfast. So you've got like vegetarian sausages, hash browns, fried eggs. Oh yeah, you have fried eggs there. Um, they do poached eggs, omelettes and things like that as well. You just have to ask the staff and they'll do it for you. The poached eggs are literally to die for though. Um, they're really nice and you've got bacon sausages. And then you got this little baby. So... Your little nut area, uh, apple juice, orange juice, more fresh fruit, water, more juices. You can make your own waffles, which is really interesting. Maple syrup, stuff. <laughs> this is so funny, this thing's literally like bigger than I am. It's like different like muffins, pastries. Right over there again. <laughs> Brett's having like normal breakfast, so I'm going a bit healthy because I start my new diet today. So yeah. Milk, sweet bix, gluten free section for those who are gluten free, which is pretty cool. Um Yeah. That's the breakfast, but I think it's really nice, so I especially love the fact that it's got smoked salmon, but it's definitely the biggest buffet selection I've seen at a hotel in the UK. Um because even the double tree by Hilton when we were there that didn't have this much of a selection from what i remember um but others no. might so no, yeah there's a wide range of options for everyone isn't it? there's a wide is. range of options for everyone there Cereals, is fruits, yeah slices hot breakfast porridge smoked salmon like you say exactly so much for everyone. exactly so yeah anyway 